Hello out there, my name is Pedro Lemus and this is Brady Christian. I own and operate Sound by Design and Safe and Sound and Brady Christian is in charge of business development here. Uh, we're proud to announce the start of Tech 5. Tech 5 is going to help us communicate with you, the general public, on any questions that you may have about technology. I've been in the business for about 28 years or so. My experience dates back to Circuit City, which is great. Um, and uh, I had a great time there, and I've had a great time running Sound by Design for the past 21 years. Brady has joined us about a couple years ago, uh, and he's learned a lot uh, in his time that he's been here. So what we're going to do with Tech 5 is really educate the public in the consumer electronics industry, uh, try to get you, you some answers on the technology that's out there, things from uh, whole house audio video. Of course, we've got some things written on the whiteboard over here. Uh, on the sound by design side, uh, our pride and joy, we do install a lot of home theaters. And for those of you guys that don't know how we qualify a home theater, uh, is it's going to be a sectioned off designated room. Typically in new construction, it'll be a bonus room upstairs, or it will be a basement of some sort. Basements are good because you can control the light and when you, when you call it a dedicated theater, it ends up being like a projection system so that that screen ends up being, what, like 110? 110, 130. Something like that where you get this movie-like experience at home. So home theater is something that we pride ourselves in, and we've installed uh, several very nice ones. Next is surround sound systems. This is what you might... Uh, tell me what a surround sound system would be, Brady. Where do we typically install surround sound systems? Typically, we put a surround sound system in a living room, den, family room, whatever you may call it, and it starts at five speakers plus one subwoofer and can go up to 11 speakers and two subwoofers, but generally we, we run in the 5.1 to 7.1 uh, range on a surround system. And it typically includes a television, you know, a TV, living area. Uh, TV mounted over a fireplace, but uh, something that we pride ourselves on is the control of the system. Yes. Uh, we will typically sell a system, and when we use that word system, uh, it would include uh, a remote control operating multiple products. Smart home automation, that's when you get deeper. It's not necessarily your, necessarily your Alexas and your Googles. That's a very consumer-friendly version of turn on lights, uh, adjust the thermostat, that's really nice. Uh, you know, I put that in the category of gadgets, but uh, whenever we can really present a beautiful lifestyle for you, that's what we really consider home automation is uh, when we're letting you not come home to a dark house, um, you can distribute audio throughout the house, which leads us to the other parts of, of a smart home automation, multi-zone audio and video. Uh, a lot of the systems that we install, there's a centralized rack of equipment uh, put in one area, uh, typically a closet or uh, an attic space now that we have foamed attics, uh, one centralized location for everything, and then you're just walking around with a remote control or your smartphones to do all that um, home automation. Networking, if you're going to build a great system like this, you've got to have a strong backbone. Networking is typically very, very important and uh, very important for Wi-Fi distribution for uh, your smartphones, uh, tablets, and all that good stuff. So we do networking, conference rooms integrations in commercial space like office buildings and whatnot. We, we do uh, uh, conference rooms. Lighting control is always very nice as well. Uh, it really sets the tone for your home uh, and lighting, as you know, is very, very important. Rounding off on safe and sound, that part of our company, uh, we do burglar alarm systems, which is the, um, you know, what you know as an alarm system, what you set a code, you leave, make sure nobody breaks in, and if they do, they alert you first and then the authorities if necessary. There is an automated portion of it where you could get uh, text or notifications if something's going on, locking doors, closing garage doors, closing and opening garage doors, uh, and, and whatnot. Camera surveillance systems, these days people want to know what's going on at home, whether it's to keep an eye on the kids while you're gone, or, or you know, if in an unfortunate event, something bad did happen at the house, you want to see the history of what it was. I would rather cameras prevent something from happening, you know, be a visual deterrent for something that's actually going on, but if it does so happen, then we've got footage of it. On the 
security side as well, uh, automation. Again, safe, Sound by Design and so Safe and Sound are the two companies that we operate. So really we're just gonna introduce Tech 5, look for us in the coming weeks with plenty of detailed technology on a lot of these subjects. And thanks for joining us today. This is a brief description of what Tech 5 is. It's typically a five minute conversation with you sharing some information. If you would like to request a topic for us to cover, leave it in the comment section. Subscribe to our channel and hit the like button. For Brady and Pedro, we are Sound by Design and Safe and Sound, making technology simple.